And new tonight at 11, a Jacksonville family is praying for justice after their 17-year-old daughter was shot to death last week out on a date. On your side's Jeff Vallon happened to interview the teenager just three months ago on a much happier occasion. And your wish? I wish I want a car. <laughs> that chance interview at Jacksonville's Christmas tree lighting in Hemming Park December 4th. Santa answered 17-year-old Anandi Weich's wish that the Rebald High School junior would be shot to death in her new car last Thursday in the 4700 block of Portsmouth Avenue. At this time, all the information we have are the uh, victims were in their vehicle. A close friend speaking for Anandi's grief-stricken mother tells us Anandi was on a date when another car pulled up. Great car, two, two-door, four-door sedan. Two guys jumped out of the car and just opened fire on the car. Her date would survive, but the shots killed this young cheerleader and model with a future as bright as her smile, her dreams including a television career. To be interviewed by you and yeah, it, it set something on, under her feet. She was, she was ready to go and we know she would have been great at it. This is a perfect spot. It's very open. She was always smiling. She walked into a room. She lights the room up. Awake and funeral are planned. But coronavirus worries are an added grief. The upset of possibly not even being able to have a proper funeral for her. We're just asking uh, everyone to be sympathetic with the family for this tragedy that has happened and be mindful of the distance that we're trying to do as far as the social gathering. For a link to funeral information, go to this story at firstcoastnews.com. The sheriff's office asks anyone with information or surveillance video from near the scene about 7 p.m. Thursday, March 19th to come forward. Especially for her mom, who in 90 was her everything. So please pray for them. Merry Christmas and have a happy new year. Jeff Vallon, First Coast News on your side.